Breaking Bad Season 2, Finale Episode 13, ADQ. In an earlier post about Breaking Bad, I'd mentioned that the show doesn't sugarcoat the world of meth and its fallout. Boy, was that assessment ever proven accurate in the Season 2 Finale Episode 13, ABQ. I'm pretty much going to thumbnail my take on this ep because it has an encore airing following the date of this post, and I don't want to do spoilers. I think it's a safe bet that anyone who is a fan of the late John Belushi will have had the same reflexive response I did while watching this episode, yelling at the TV, speedballs kill. Okay, technically a speedball is a combination of cocaine and heroin, not meth and heroin, but that definition would be splitting hairs since the rush of combining two powerful antithetical drugs is the objective. And, of course, the danger increases with the substitution of meth because it has a bolder kick than cocaine. Also, if one has built up a tolerance for the drugs, the likelihood of overdosing increases. Chemical reaction will not be denied. Kudos to Breaking Bad for letting the audience know that's the double truth, Ruth. I also have to hand it to the Breaking Bad crew for the natural ebb and flow of this episode very much a day in the life of Walt White. It has that feel to it. He's still dealing with juggling the double life he's living, his cancer treatments, the day-to-day of being a husband and father, and wheeling and dealing with another power player and prospective distributor in the meth trade, an extremely smooth operator played by Giancarlo Esposito. Walt's consigliere, Saul Goodman, is the go-between for that introduction. If Bob Odenkirk does not get an Emmy for his Saul, then the governing body has not paid close enough attention. This up had a bit of everything to entertain. Joy. Walt is so sweet when he's holding his newborn daughter. I defy anyone not to go, aww, in all of his scenes with the baby. Frustration. Jesse's a good kid, but he makes many bad decisions. Also, I could throttle Skylar for the decision that she makes about her and Walt's marriage. Shock and awe, kid on the bike. Humor, seesaw, and heartbreak. Jesse and Jane's dad, Donald, played by one of my longtime faves, John Delancey. And, of course, my favorite thing of all about the season two, episode 13 finale, is that it gives us a cliffhanger and... All the plot clues that were sprinkled throughout the preceding episodes are answered and resolved. Can't hardly wait until AMC gives the start date for Breaking Bad Season 3. They have been picked up, but no start date as yet. Till next time.